Hi friends, it's Ange from Plans with Ange, and today we are back with a, another video. So this week we are doing a different kind of video. So we are doing a summer bucket list video. And throughout the month, I am doing different series here where I will be trying to incorporate new stuff on the channel and different things that also exhibit, you know, my planner life. So this one is a fun one that the boys and I discovered. We have a huge list that I wrote down everything on and we're not going to get through everything, but we have a general idea. So I cut up some cardstock and I'm going to make this a tip in into my cousin over here. So I already cut it to size. So we have that ready. And then I got my pencil and then I picked up my mild liners so that we can color those in. So since this is like a summer theme, I am going to just make it summery and fun. So I am no artist whatsoever, but I'm going to try and just make it cute and stuff. I was thinking like a rainbow and then maybe like some clouds up here or the sun. And those can be like different things that we fill in. So let's just get this started. And then I will try to fast forward some of this so you don't have to see me drawing everything. Rolling. Okay, so I'm trying to think, because we got a lot of stuff here. Um, and some of this we've already done, so we can kind of fill it in as we go. And I might make some clouds and some sun, just different kind of summery things, maybe some flowers. Um, we'll see. All right, so that's pretty much good so far. Let's look at our list and see what we've got. All right, so the list, let's zoom in just a little bit. I'll just go through everything. Um, again, well, some of these we can't do, but I just wrote them all down. So we wrote going to the beach, going to the freeze, which is a local like ice cream shop and they have some food that we have in town, have a picnic, play at the park, go camping, plant a garden, go to three new parks, um, the underground mine with Andrew, which is my husband, go to the zoo, go on a hike, go canoeing, go fishing, play sports, barbecuing, bonfire, water park, go to a hotel, see daddy, visit mountain monuments, go to the fair, sleep in, Build Lego sets outside, go hunting, finish the house, a water balloon fight, a water gun fight, and a family trip. So collectively, these were ideas from myself and my husband. Um, you can kind of see which ones <laughs> were from who. And then my three kids, so two, six, and a 10 year old. So different ideas throughout the whole thing. Um, we try to keep it cohesive so that we can all do it together and make it like a fun family thing. So I'm just gonna go and just m mark off the things that we've done so far um, and add them to um, our thing. Um, we attempted to go on a hike, but then the bugs were so bad, so that did not happen. We had a bonfire, went to a water park. We seen daddy. Mm. We built Lego sets, but not technically outside still working on that and we went on a family trip already and we'll be going on a one here soon actually tomorrow so 
let's just get some of these on paper and I'm just gonna write slightly on them so I can start coloring them in as well. So we'll see some of these, I might just like add more to like the petals, but we'll see. I'm just gonna write the freeze because I know what that is. Plant a garden. Let's see. We had a bonfire. We went to the water park, which was also on our vacation. A hotel. Um, see daddy. That one I think was from Kingston, which is my two year old. And um, let's see a family trip. So these are the ones that we have done so far. And you can see that we have so many other things that we can do. Um, this one we won't be able to do this year because it's closed. We already attempted. Um, for some reason it's not available this year. So let's just start coloring it in and kind of figuring out where everything should go. So I'm just using my mild liners. I got this awesome set from Go Wild. It was one of the swag items on my table. So that was fun. And then I just have another piece of paper underneath to kind of give it um, some protection in case it bleeds through because we don't want it to bleed. So I just stepped aside to grab a piece of paper, ignore it because I was already getting color on my desk and I do not want that. So these don't color very well. I thought about my permanent markers, but definitely don't want those to bleed either. So I'm going to keep coloring and then I'll be back when I'm done. All right, so I'm back and I've colored everything in. Um, I realized afterwards that the color went over. Coloring them in um, with my liners was not the best idea, but we learn and I don't want to like go back in time and refix everything. So this is what we have for right now. So at the end of this video, there is going to be a recap uh, a giveaway that I have actually currently going on on my Instagram channel. So if you guys just type in plans with Anne's on Instagram, you will definitely find that. I don't know why I was coloring a bonfire and I wanted to do it with that color, but that did not work. So yeah, at the end of this video, I will have some details. You can kind of see what we have for the giveaway and you guys can enter because one of the rules is you have to subscribe to my 
YouTube channel as part of the giveaway details. So we have that as well. But I am just going to finish coloring in all of these little details and I will come back when this is all done. All right, friends, so this is everything. I finished up what I have so far. Again, I will be working on the rest and filling this in and kind of showing you what we have going on. So I did outline some of the rest of them even though we didn't fill them in, but that is our summer 22 bucket list and I'll be back for Next part time two. Back. Um, after the summer bucket list video and showing you the details of the giveaway. So currently on my Instagram, I have reached over 1,000 subscribers, which is a huge goal of mine. And I've been trying to do this for a couple of years and it finally worked. So you can check out the details and the rules all over there. And right now I'm just going to go into the details of what you'll get here. So let's just get to these stickers. So you will receive one whole Macy mail subscription from Planner Monkey Co. And I will show you all that you will get here in this subscription. This is super cute with all of the cherry blossoms. I love it with all the different added elements. And Macy, the little monkey, is like super adorable. So that is part of the things that you will receive. Super cute and very minimal, but decorative, okay? So you will also receive a Hobonichi Cousin sticker kit. So some of these, the giveaway is like some of my favorite things. So I'm gonna share some of my favorite things. So this is a kit from Saucy Stickers Co. It is called Daydream and it comes on two pages and it's just super pretty and vibrant. My favorite color is purple, and I just love the fairy vibe. So I'm parting with this for the giveaway. All right, so next we have a planner, like a, a pouch. And I just got this off Amazon. It's nothing too crazy. Um, we have two zippers here, and it kind of has like some pockets on the side, but then it expands and the rest of the giveaway stuff is inside. So this is going to be a awesome giveaway. So I pulled everything aside. I can unzip it so you can kind of see everything when it's completely unzipped. You get this pocket here and another pocket and then the same on the other side except this one has that mesh material. And then you also get a zipper pouch as well. So this is the little pouch that you get, super cute. And it's great, very versatile. So you're also going to receive a brand new um, spring, to, um, April start Hobonichi Weeks. And it's also in purple, I haven't opened it yet. Um, I can show you more of what the Hobonichi Weeks looks like um, at another time if you'd like. So there is that, and it definitely does fit. Um, if you notice, I had everything in here. So it fits perfectly, and you still have some room for everything that you need. And then I am sharing, oh my goodness, which one is it? Three of my favorite utensils, I already used them. So the first one is the Sharpie S gel in a 0.7 millimeters. I will show you this is what it looks like. And I'll write it on a piece of paper. Actually, no, it wasn't what I used. I can kind of show you how it writes. It's super smooth. This is one of them, the pens that I use very consistently throughout the week. And then earlier in this video, I used a Sharpie pen, which is really nice and it writes on most um, papers. I know, especially the vinyl, like from Sweet Kawaii Design, and then a full Micron um, um, pack of pens, and they have the ones, three, and five. 
so the different font sizes or i mean pointed tips so that is cool i love the microns they are definitely my favorite and then this is from print pression it is a ceramic pen cutter so if you can see there's a really fine tip there and it slices like your washi or your stickers and then lastly that i have physical is a um, washi set from simply gilded this was in the pre-sale super pretty with this rose pink so this was everything that you get physically just you know laid out here um, again i will go through this on instagram as well with more details if you want more information go to my instagram account in addition to everything that you see here you will also be getting a 20 dollars shop credit to one of my favorite sticker shops which is sprouted paper co it was super hard for me to choose one so i chose that so that's everything you need to do so make sure you go to instagram check out the rules and you can figure out how to win all of these amazing things but that's it for this entire video this time i'm for real and i will see you guys later see ya